Man, the experiments have a lot of luggage. Especially Mika. She packed basically everything. But it sure was nice of Clarissa to loan me this bus for all my experiments to fit inside of. <laughs> yes, sir, this thing can go for miles. Wow, you guys sure have packed everything. You may never know, Lloyd. That stuff will most likely come in handy. I concur with Jilly. Our goods and chattels are required to have some form of purpose for... <clears throat> Okay, Mr. Smiley Pants, we get it. Be lucky you guys aren't Rocky. He's carrying his suitcase on his back. It's all right, Hatchet. Michelle don't mind. Wait a sec, Glacia. What's with the cooler? This is my suitcase. Okay, head count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, and sixteen. Good, you're all here. Hmm. I'd rather just stay here. What's the point of going back to Bossa if I've already served my purpose? Rouge, Bossa's our home. All of us experiments live there every time it's in session. I just don't like the idea of being crammed in a bus with 15 other experiments. But they're our friends, Rouge. If anything, it should be a good thing. I wouldn't say friends. Mika is too assertive, I only tolerate Goober, Dash is too egotistical, it takes forever to wait on Rocky, I find Warrior a little obnoxious, and Jilly is basically a garbage disposal. Got any trash? Rouge, this bus ride isn't even that long. It only takes 40 minutes to drive back to Bassa. 40 minutes?! I can watch almost an entire episode of WWE SmackDown in that time! Please don't tell me I have to spend the next 40 minutes of my life smelling Skippy's sweat! Skippy was already seen with Airbow Rouge. Rouge Elizabeth Barnes, you will behave on the bus ride back to school, and you will not cause any mayhem! Do I make myself clear, young lady? Yes, Doc. Okay, that's better. Let's get going now. <clears throat> Feels nice that we get to ride this big, spacious bus back to Bossa, eh, Dougie? Couldn't agree more, Lloyd. This is way bigger than I expected. I just hope Rouge doesn't misbehave. Don't worry, Douglas. Gordon told Rouge to be on her best behavior. Yeah, but Rouge isn't usually a role follower. Yo, Lloyd, Doug, you fellas realize Rouge is in the seat behind you, right? <laughs> Rouge, you better not be up to anything. Don't talk to me while I'm pouting. <gasps> How is she, Mika? She's being a bit of a sour grape. I heard that. Anyone need to take a bathroom break? Now would be the time to do it. <laughs> I wonder if this gas station has a shake maker. I sure do hope I don't get strained here this time. Be faster, Rocky, then you won't be. I'm good, so I'll just wait here. This also gives me the perfect opportunity to check on Rouge and see how she's doing. <laughs> oh boy, what could she be smiling about? Excuse me, Rouge, but why the scheming face? Douglas, my dude, I just thought of a way to make this bus ride bearable. Come on, Doug. Let's go have some fun! Hold on, Rouge! We're allowed to have fun, but I will not do anything that is considered breaking the law. Douglas, honey, you can turn invisible. So if we did do something bad, you'd never get caught. Well, I can turn invisible, but you can't. <laughs> He's right. No need to front! I don't want to break the law either. Besides, Gordon won't even notice we're gone. Because I made this decoy of myself in case of emergencies. Wow. What about me? Oh, I've got a plan. <laughs> so, what's going on, Rouge? So, here's the plan, Skippy. 
We need you to pretend to be Douglas for 45 minutes while the real Douglas and I go do something exciting. And don't tell Gordon, or else you're going to get hit in the eyeballs with a mace. Uh, uh, all right, uh, I'll pretend to be Douglas. How's this? Perfect. I'll even give you 20 bucks if Gordon doesn't notice. Sweet deal. This is weirding me out a little. So is everyone satisfied? Yeah, I think we are. What is this thing? All right, let's get going now. What on earth, Rouge? Because of you, the bus is leaving without us. Hey, hey, don't worry. We'll catch up to them. But for now, let's have fun. We can even do what you want. Now come on, let's get going. But, but my luggage. Huh. <laughs> Come on, Douglas! The world is our oyster! <laughs> Ugh, those tiny, barely any good experiments are old news. My own three experiments are much more relevant. <sighs> when we get our hands on Ninja, he's gonna wish he was never born. Destruction is my only reason to live. Me want to shred weak, useless experiments apart. Uh, Ace, my best experiment. Please come forward. Yes, Neville? Go get those two puny experiments and use your mighty power to terminate them. Yes, Master, I obey. Hey, boss, what about me and cross you? Me hungry for puny experiments! Oh, don't worry. When Ace catches those little experiments, you two can eat them. Uh, sounds perfect. <laughs> hey, Douglas, do you happen to know where Skippy is? Oh, no. What do I tell her? Uh, uh, maybe Skippy is somewhere else on the this bus. I wouldn't know. Wait a minute. Your voice sounds kind of off. And why does Rouge suddenly look like a rag doll with a dyed mop on her head? Uh, 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 Douglas, what's going on? Uh, uh, I confess! I'm not Douglas! It was me, Skippy, the whole time! The real Douglas and Rouge went out to do who knows what. Please don't tell Gordon. Rouge said she paid me $20 if I could pull this off. But now it looks like those $20 aren't going to my, not going to my wallet! <laughs> well, well, where are they? Come to think of it. I have no idea. Wait, look! Something's going on out there! Huh? Mm, stay back, you behemoth! Quit chasing us! Oh, what's that I hear? Must be the wind. Now time to meet your doom, you little rats! <laughs> Blast you, ninja! Ninja? I think he needs that guy. Uh, Ace, you need to learn to pick on somebody your own size. Whoa, you saved us. Thank you. Don't talk to me. I don't associate with anyone. <sighs> what an edgelord. There you guys are. We need you to come back now. You still owe me $20. Rouge, is it okay if we go back to Bossa now? Yes, Douglas, it is okay. When we get back, Gordon's probably going to punish me in the most harsh way possible. Uh, 